Horry County Council took up a controversial development project that would bring new homes and businesses to Postal Way in Carolina Forest. Council heard from both outspoken sides on this development. WMBF's Eric Richards is live in the control room now with more from tonight's pretty heated meeting. There were some fireworks tonight, Eric. Oh yes, there were, Eric. And at times during the meeting, frustrations appeared to boil over between council members and the public. In the end, though, it was decided more discussion is needed in order to make an informed decision. Mr. DeSmile, let her finish and then you can I, respond. I'm tired of hearing the same argument every meeting, Mr. Chairman. It's the same thing over and over and over again. A somewhat heated discussion during tonight's county council meeting connected to the proposed postal way development project. Already overcrowded schools, a big topic. I can't halt projects when we're not getting feedback from Horry County Schools. I understand what you're saying. It's not our responsibility to do their job, but if we keep cramming more students on them, you know, we have to, to work with them. There is no reason why there shouldn't have been some forethought on why we don't have another high school in the area. Traffic and infrastructure also on the minds of many in attendance. Adding extra lanes and a roundabout on post away is not going to alleviate the stress on our infrastructure. That I wasn't going to support it unless that was added. I wanted interconnectivity between the two projects so that there would be increased flow of traffic from the density created by the project to the impact on first responders, including firefighters. So there's currently no additional stations planned in that location, but it is a challenge every single day uh, as we deal with the growth throughout this community. I'm a retired firefighter and I and with the influx of the people moving down here, the amount of building that's going in here, the traffic is terrible. One of the developers addressed the council. We are supplying the necessary roadway improvements um, that this development requires to support it. We're going above and beyond that. So the council moved to defer the vote on the second reading so that they could have more discussion about this controversial project. No date, though, has been set on when they will continue their discussion. A, commu a community meeting is also being planned right now for Carolina Forest residents to attend. The exact date for that also has not been released. Either way, you can count on us to be there at those meetings and bring you the very latest developments. For now, though, the rezoning application has hit a snag. Eric, over to you.